Okay, so throughout the past four years of my YouTube career, I haven't really done a full-on video of my collection of sprint car memorabilia or whatever you guys want to call it. Sw sprint car related stuff. Um, so today we'll be doing that. Alright, we'll be starting off with a 164 diecast, which is pretty much my whole collection. So, here we go. 2017 Donnie Shots, 2018, 2021, 2020. I have no clue why they're out of order. I'll have to fix that after this. Casey Heeser, I hope I'm saying that right. Lauren Densley, Rico Abreu, Rico Abreu. Jamie Veal, r, r Tony Stewart, Corey Eliason signed. Brad Sweet, r and r and Lucas Wolf r and r But that's not really it. Like, I got the 164 Danny Lasoski up here and a couple more just scattered throughout my room. Then, if you take a look in here, here's all the cars that I've opened and can't find the package for. So, mostly my childhood cars that I had when I was little. I've got a couple of valuable ones in here, like the Jason Myers right there, um, the Randy Hannigan, the 83, the, the Beef Packer, Danny Lasowski, um, Tommy Tarleton, um, the Bud Kading, and I even got a, a Brent Kading right here. And, you know, just a couple more. I got another Tommy Tarleton right there. I got the Bass Pro Shops, 11 Steve Kinzer, but that one's... Uh, sadly broken, but maybe I'll get it again someday, but yeah. Over here, you got a random shelf that I decided to put on the wall, but um, these are all the 2021, I think, Acme 164s that you can't put back in the package because if you guys remember, you literally couldn't. It was just sealed, so had to cut it open and couldn't do that. So yeah, here's all of them. Then you got the racing... Ch Wait, no, these aren't the racing champions. These are the Action Platinum Series 164s that they didn't make a lot of these. I think they probably only made like maybe 8 to 10. I could be mistaken, but just correct me in the comments. But um, yeah, I'm looking forward to getting the Andy Hillenberg one. I've been seeing it on eBay, so hopefully I'll get that uh, pretty soon. Then if you come over here, you got the 2022 Acme 164s. You got Logan Wagner, Chase Stockton, Chase Elliott, Casey Kane. Bud Kading, Brent Marks, Brock Zierfoss, Justin Peck, Danny Dietrich, Logan Schuhart, Brian Brown, Donnie Schatz, Lucas Wolf, Lance Deweese, and Aaron Reitzel. Then if any of you are wondering where all my 150 scale diecast are from Acme, they are in the living room right now as I'm filming for the reboot series, uh, so here's a quick sneak peek for that. I think it's turned out pretty good so far. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. I think it looks really good. But anyways, getting back to the collection, here's the 150 scale GMP die cast. I have a good amount of them, so I guess we'll be starting on the bottom. Fred Raymer, Bobby Davis Jr. I'm actually going to make a video on him soon. I'm not sure if it's going to be an individual video about him or I'll add him into the Vanished Talent series, so just not really sure. There will be a video on including him soon. Andy Hillenberg, Knoxville Nationals car, Stevie Smith, Donnie Schatz, Jeff Swindell, Jack Honshield, Doug Wolfgang, Tyler Walker, Danny Lasowski, Jack Hewitt, Bobby Allen, and Greg Hodnett. If you look up here, you got three Action Platinum Series 150 scale die cast, then you got three 124 scale die cast, and one 118 die cast. Then you got a signed helmet from Donnie Schatz, and a couple of signed things, you know, pretty much everything. You even got the 360 game up there, signed by Craig Kinzer. And for the final part of this video, I'll be showing you guys my Wall of Fame. Pretty much just posters on my wall, so we'll be starting off with the Jonathan Allard poster. Roth Classic, uh, autograph thing, the PS2 game advertisement poster, the front cover of the PS2 game, Steve Kinzer Hall of Fame poster, um, Flying Outlaws, Andy Hillenberg's Lux there poster card, a signed hat by him, a 2011 King of the West poster, I think it's 2011, yeah 2011, and um, Ascot the Golden Years poster. But sprint car racing isn't the only stuff I collect, like I collect Marvel stuff, DC stuff, uh, just posters of my favorite movies, King Kong posters, that's one of my favorite franchises, MonsterVerse, whatever you want to call it, King Kong, Godzilla, got a couple of them up here, and yeah, horror movies, and whatever you, whatever you, you can think of, I probably like it.
But anyways, this was my sprint car collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said earlier, let me know in the comments what you guys think of the sneak peek. I think using coffee grounds for cushion looks really realistic in my opinion. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video and yeah, see ya.